today we are going to create kgf like text or title animation using a light motion this tutorial is going to be a little long so please watch the complete tutorial if you would like to learn how to do the animation like this using a light motion app let's start for kgf like title animation we will need some assets such as font one image which will be the texture for the text and two videos one for the outline around the letters or or the text and second will be the background pixabay is the website where you can find the stock videos and stock images which are free to use for even for commercial use so if you read pixabay license it says free for commercial use no attribution required so basically you can download and use them for free you don't need to pay anything you can also register this website or even without registering you can download all the assets sometimes it will show captcha just to check that you are a human and not a robot once it verifies it will let you download the files without even registering on the website so when you click on free download button it shows different resolutions for images and the videos for this tutorial please download 1280 by 720 resolution videos both of them so i will just show uh, how the videos look like i will play them so this will be for the outline of the text the second video is the background here also after clicking on the free download select 1280 by 720 I have already downloaded it, so I am not going to download them I am just showing you so this will be the texture image for the text and please select 1280 by 960 resolution for the image last is the font which is also uh, free to use for commercial purpose once you click on the download ttf button it will download the zip file after downloading please extract the file so there will be file called black ops 1.ttf which we will need to import in a light motion so that we can use that font inside the light motion so all of these assets are free of cost you can also use them in the uh, commercial projects of yours so let's get started with the actual tutorial for this kg of title animation we will create two elements one for the text outline another for the text texture as elements can be reused for each different letter k g and f that will make our job easier when we will create the project click on plus button select element rename it to text texture aspect ratio 1 is to 1 resolution and frame rate you can choose according to your needs for the elements background is by default transparent you can't change it even if you click on it it's grayed out create the element click on plus button click on text write k make it centric change the font click on view all fonts as we want to use the font which we downloaded for this tutorial to import the fonts click on import fonts button go to the location where the font is located in my case it's under the download folder there is a folder black ops 1 and again inside that there is a file with extension ttf which is for the font select it it will be imported click on imported button to filter it out you can see now that font inside the light motion select it the font for the letter is not changed increase the size of the text to the maximum click ok increase the timeline for the text to six seconds as i want to create animation which will last for Six seconds
okay this is okay click on plus button click on image and video select the image which we downloaded for the background move that layer below the text click on the image file click on the forward arrow once more so that it goes to the sixth second and at the top near to this clock there is a button which shows that extend the timeline for that selected layer so once it's clicked automatically the timeline for the image is increased select the text or the letter okay go to the blending and opacity scroll down click on mask and select mask so the first element is ready for us go to the elements you will see the element which you just created now we will create the second element which is text outline for that we will use the text texture element we will just duplicate it for that hold the text texture it will show three different options on the top click on the second one which is duplicate the element open the text texture copy element rename it to text outline delete the layer background image select the letter change the blending opacity to normal go into the color and fill no fill click on border and shadow enable the stroke increase it to 5 go back now we want to add the video which we downloaded from pixabay for the outline so click on image and video click on view all and go to the folder where the video has been downloaded in my case it's under the download folder select the video play it to make sure it is the one which we want to add click on the plus button it will be added now drag that layer below the letter now the letter is on top of the video go to the sixth second in the timeline and select the video layer trim the right hand side of the video select the text change now the blending and opacity from normal to the mask okay select the letter duplicate it now click on the one layer of the text go to the timing to 30 yeah and trim the right hand side of that later and around the same time select the sorry, the top layer and trim the left hand side of that layer okay so the timeline should look like this select the bottom text layer click on the effects click on the add effect go to the drawing and age select glow select standard settings reduce the radius reduce alpha a little bit and maybe the hardness also so alpha is 49% hardness is 0 
radius is 29 change the color from yellow to red which is present uh, in that again click on the add effect go to the drawing and age select the drawing properties scroll down select the last preset flow from start to end let's play it okay it looks good to me now select that layer click on the effects click on this th three dots copy effects and we will paste them on the top text layer click on the effects click on the three dots and then paste effects but this time we will delete the drawing progress we will click on the add effect go again to drawing and age click on drawing progress and then we will select the preset draw gradually okay and let's see this animation now so it's little fast I will click on it go to the effects click on the drawing progress select the end because the keyframes are added for the end option select the second keyframe move it to around 430 and again see the animation how it looks now it's okay for me so both the elements have been created now we will create the project to create a project click on plus button make sure the project is selected rename it to kgf aspect ratio 16 as to 9 resolution 720p frame rate 60 fps same as what we selected for the both elements background this time black create project click on the plus button go to the elements select text outline first so it will be added again go to the plus button go to the elements this time select text texture now you see the effect like around the letter there is something burning and that is what we wanted select both layers duplicate them on the text outline below the one of the text texture so that we know that there is one layer for text texture then another layer for the text outline exactly below it again select two of them duplicate them move this text outline at the top so we have k we want now the next letter g and f so click on the third layer because the first two are for the K and we want to keep it as it is. After selecting click on element properties, write G letter, click OK, then go to the text texture that is the fourth layer from the bottom, again click on the element properties, write G. Then the next one, fifth layer, write F and text texture again here, F. Now we have all the letters together, um, select text texture at the bottom which is K letter, click on move and transform, move it to the left hand side around this. Select text texture of F, go to the move and transform, move it to the right. We need to move the text outline to those exact positions. So select the text outline below the K letter, which is the very first layer. Move the timing a little bit so that we can see some lines. Or maybe at the end where we can see the complete letter. Yeah. 
so click on move and transform move it to the left like that looks okay to me select the text outline which is exactly below the F which is the fifth from the bottom go to the move and transform move it to the right hand side this looks good to me let's play it okay it looks good enough now we need to do some changes into the elements again to make it perfect select the layer text texture of the k later go to the effects click on add effect go to the color and light under that you will find exposure and camera click on that select standard settings click on gamma reduce it till it's very little visible on the screen or slightly visible on the screen that's what i mean add a keyframe for the gamma then move the timeline till the whole open is visible so it's i think around 430 and at that point increase gamma till it looks reddish click on the three dots we need to copy effect and apply it to g and f text texture layer so select the g effects three dots paste effect same for f letter click on it go to the effects three dots paste effect play the animation Ah, it looks good now click on the text outline at the bottom go to the effects click on add effect click on exposure and gamma again if we increase the exposure it looks more brighter Think this much brighter is okay so now we will copy this one and apply to the text outlines of the other letter so the another is for the G click on the effects paste it the last one is for the F effects paste it again play the animation it looks perfect to me now there is a last step which is adding the background video click on the plus button click on image and video view all again go to the folder where you have downloaded the background video so in my case it's under the download folder Play the video to make sure that it's really the background video click on the plus button it will be added select that uh, hold this button by selecting that layer move it completely at the bottom go to the sixth second select that video trim the right hand side of the video go at the start and play the animation okay 
in this it will be looking a little bit choppy because we have so heavy files like videos images so it might not be smooth but once you export this video it should look better so let's play it once again yeah it looks good to me so thanks for watching this tutorial if you like this video then please like write some comments about which type of videos you would like from me please subscribe to my channel stay healthy stay safe bye bye